So I see in the comments we got some haters. Ooh. Already as expected. And then we have a couple people that say that the FRT is not meant for the 22, okay. which, like I said, I'm here to prove y'all wrong. I did go back into my editing software to edit um, Hoffman's plate because I noticed some things um, with it not wanting to reset properly. So I will be showing y'all that in this video as well. I'm going to cut straight to the chase. All the kinks are worked out. Timing is perfect everything like that so we are looking you know in the right ballpark the other night i got about five off and uh man so cut to the chase let's get it all right we got four shots as long as the bullets cooperate we, we should be good It's going to speak time and perfect, everything like that. We good. There we go. Told y'all. So here's the piece that I was uh, really excited to show y'all. Um, so I had to go in and um, re-edit this a little bit. If you can see the one with the seven on it is one of the originals. Now, this number is uh, the number for a reason. Um, and the reason is um, in Kira, I usually have to make them a tad bit bigger. I'm not going to give no specific numbers, um, but yeah a tad bit bigger than the original copy of them so with this one in particular this is the my two millimeter two millimeter um riser plate that's what i'm calling it but the original plate was developed by hoffman tactical and um i have a another plate that's a little bit higher it's a three millimeter but the two millimeter has been working so far so that's how i got the bolt to lock up so good now okay so here's the auto trip that i've been using in all my videos um and there's one thing that i did edit i'm not too sure if i explained that in the last video but i edited this little um trip point right here so it's no longer using m3 nuts uh to trip the point it's actually using its own 3d printed um, piece and uh for my timing i marked it you know right here with a little blue marker um so that was perfect for me this is how it come off the printer or how it will look coming off the printer now i don't have to use this raft but on my old setup with my old bed there wasn't sticking as well so i haven't edited the raft out but the rafts are easy to remove um, like I said, you just match. Well, I'm gonna I'm definitely I'm gonna do a. I think I'll do like a a symbol assembly assembly video or something like that. And people they people they say that it could not be done. I got a lot of strange hate in the comments. Um, but what they don't know is, um, when you design, you can't copy and paste or none of that dumb bullshit that you think you can. Uh, um, do the only thing you can do is more than likely just upload a canvas and try to copy from a canvas but even that's hard um so yeah so this little piece right here is doing most of the work without it it don't it don't even function you get one shot and a dead trigger so 3d printing has come a long long way and um i'm really pretty fairly new in the designing so you know i'm not too worried about what you guys got to say haters you know what i'm saying if you hating you know keep hating it's gonna motivate your kid you feel what i'm saying but 
all in the same time, you know, this little piece is what's tripping everything. And they said it could not be done, um, but it has been done and by me. And I'm proud to say it. Also, CMMG is they hit me back up with another update saying that they're as a matter of fact, they hit me up saying that they was going to give me a discount on um, the auto trip that they're sending me for waiting so long. So that's a good thing. Um, they sent me my money and I still get the item. So also another thing y'all do not know is I've never built an AR 15 until this year. Um, I got all the pieces that I needed to build one. Um, and I got into wanting to build one because I seen the FRT. I, I would just got psyched and, uh, you know, that fast shooting, you know what I'm saying? With it, you know, being a fast shooting trigger without it being an automatic weapon that just drew me into it. Um, but now I know a lot about AR 15s and a lot about designing and a lot about 3d printing and, you know, that's, you know, to me, that's the more important thing to it all. Um, it's not really about really on trying to shine because like while y'all sleep, I'm sitting here, you know, trying to figure out, well, how can I get this thing to work better? You know what I'm saying? Extensive, you know, time and effort put into actually getting this thing to where I got it to t till today. Um, another thing is if you ain't a designer, are you not into this type of stuff? Your input means shit to me. Like, it means nothing. Like, it's just, like I said, it's just hate. You know what I'm saying? If you don't like what I'm posting, um, just don't watch the video. Another thing is, I've never held, seen, or touched an auto trip at all. I've Matter of fact, I lied. I've seen one on the internet. But I'm waiting on um the auto, the, the auto trip from CMMG right now. So... I've never, you know what I'm saying, touched one, yada, yada, but yet I've built one from just viewing something. So long story short, I'm just I'm just saying this to put it out there. I'm not trying to be cocky or anything, but y'all could take it how y'all want to. But from someone that's, you know, just getting into 3D printing, designing, CAD software, you know, I didn't go to school for it, nothing like that. I think I did a pretty damn good job in creating this little piece right here. So, if you don't like it, kiss my ass.